okay uh, uh, to create a google earth engine account you just have to simply go to google and search for google earth engine you will be seeing the result of this google earth engine link click on the first link that appears uh, it will redirect you to the google earth engine uh, platform uh, you will see a number of details here but to create a, a google earth engine uh, account to uh, create and perform the analysis geospatial analysis you will have to go to platform and click on this code editor okay now uh, it will tell you uh, to sign in with your google uh, since uh, i already have this uh, detail here you can use another account if you have different account so i'm just clicking here and uh, allowing it to sign in with my uh, google account okay once it is here it will ask you uh, to uh, register a new project so i will just click on uh, i am i want to register a new project okay great so uh, once you are here you need to select the country so I'm from Nepal so I'm selecting this Nepal and you, you have to agree with this Google Cloud uh, platform terms and uh, conditions so you read these terms and conditions and uh, select on this agree and also if you want to take get uh, any email updates you can check to, uh, in it it is not compulsory you can either check in or not so after accepting this click on this agree and continue okay great now uh, we do we haven't created any project so I will just create one project here you can give the name of the project as your wish as I am I'm just leaving this uh, uh, with the same name that has appeared uh, you uh, for now uh, the free version is allowing only 12 projects to be created so uh, uh, I'm not giving any information regarding this organization so since it is my uh, personal account so after getting all this information you can click on this create created the account now you need to go uh, not a commercial but see if you are eligible for commercial okay you have to go here uh, you need to check whether you are eligible for non-commercial use or not so I will just start with get started okay now uh, select your organization type since uh, normally what we select is either you can select for students uh, if you are student staffs uh, so for now i will be selecting this one and i'll click on next you read this will you receive uh, any payment including fee of service for commercial uh, this done include uh, resource only grants okay you just check no and how will describe your earth engine i will select this uh, source engine what is your research question okay for example I can just write like what is the coverage of forest fire what is geography story I will just go with uh, regional and I will write as KS for example you can specify your specific region it can be like okay for now let's just say South Asia have you published uh, on this topic of Earth Engine if you have published you can say yes if no you can say no for now I just select no check eligibility okay there is some problem I guess okay what is the name of your academic institution okay I can write AC mode AC sorry uh, okay I will be writing Kathmandu University for now okay right okay then we'll check for best answer you are eligible okay you are eligible so
start working on it well, a pricing plan is not required for non-commercial registration next describe your mitigation adaptation protection and conservation uh, since it is a forest fire i would say like uh, maybe protection and conservation uh, depending on what you work so you can multiple check also so will you use in the earth engine for any of the following uh, agriculture you can i may use agriculture i may use machine learning okay uh, i may use disaster crisis forestry maybe okay okay for now i'm just selecting this much of it okay then click on next how would you describe your use okay have it. these are the answers i had made to make changes okay once you give all the information click on registration right to complete registration please enable the user api okay you just have to click on enable that's great okay finally your you are now registered for non-commercial use i will click on this continue got it okay these are the overview now go here okay now go here and search for this code dot editors uh, code dot earth engine dot google dot com right once you click here uh, an existing project click on existing project and you will find your project here right click here and select now you are ready to this, is, this thing has recently been changed so you have to be careful with how you create the project okay so now i'll just i don't know <laughs> just let's just make one print first code write the code and run see it is done great thank you for watching